hey guys welcome to um my brand new channel um i just wanted to do a nice quick chill first video um just chat to you guys do my makeup um yeah so that's what i'm gonna be doing um a disclaimer no way shape or form a professional at the time and this is in general in life i have no idea what i'm doing so don't come for me and my life is all I'm gonna say. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna start off. I did record me doing my makeup yesterday and it stopped recording halfway and I didn't notice till I finished. <laughs> so I already did my skincare all day when I took a shower or whatever. So my skin is nice and prepped. So this is gonna be my first time, second time, sorry, I used yesterday, trying the Super Goop Glow Screen SPF 40. I believe this is new for them. I know they have the unseen screen, um, but I have more dry skin. It's like a, looks kind of like foundation-ish, but it does leave your skin nice and tacky. Um, I did not do a wear test like so i can't speak on like how it wears throughout the day with foundation because your girl wore it to her living room and then took it off but it does leave a nice little sheen um i think if you have like a nice skincare routine a nice hydrating skincare routine um this would be you know really nice it's not hydrating per se but um I guess that can also work for anybody that's oily, not super oily, but you still want some type of glow. Um, if that's what you're into, all that good stuff. Um, yeah, so I was actually in my first, um, or my foundation. Where's my foundation? It's right next to the camera. That was my first um, order that I did for the VIB sale. Did you guys order anything? Let me know if you did. I made three orders. I'm still waiting for two. One will be here tomorrow. So I will probably record some other stuff because I'm super excited. Um, so I'm taking my NARS foundation in Sealand Light 6. This is always my shade when I'm not tan, which is like always. I got color match for that, and then I feel like when I apply it, you'll see. I feel like it's too yellow. I don't know if you're able to. Okay, this is the Wet and Wild sponge, and I'm really enjoying it. Yesterday was my first time using it. But I used it with this NARS foundation. Which I don't like this. I don't like it. I'm going to try to find somebody that's kind of my shade. And give it away. Also, don't worry about my eyebrows. I don't fill them in, just so you know. Like, they're thick as hell. I'm not adding nothing to them. And then I also ordered the... I'm going to do a little bit because, like I said, my... Their eyes are crazy. <laughs> If 
you're dry, why are you putting on powder? Listen, I crease. Leave me alone. And these are new what I'm about wild brushes that I ordered from Amazon. So, I don't know, I'm not loving how dense this one is for bronzer. I got this one from a boxy charm a long time ago. It's from Moda. It says RNL Moda Pro BMX 130. It's a pointed blush brush, but I like it for my bronzer. Have a lot of powder on our face so i'm gonna go ahead and fix plus might have been too much but oof. i might do a pink look it's a pink look i'm feeling it so like i said i'm gonna try out the putty eye primer I'm a mess. I didn't clean my brushes. And I did a crazy eye look yesterday. So they're like... <laughs> Leave me alone. Leave me alone. It's okay. Right? Don't judge me. I hope you guys are staying safe or staying home if you can and if you're an essential worker um thank you for all that you do for all that you're doing like i know it's not easy i'm not an essential worker but my boyfriend is my dad is my brother is um and it's just tough you know but we're gonna get through this Eventually, you know, eventually. But I just want to say that I hope you guys are staying safe. So I'm going to go in with OG from the Amrezy palette. Right here. Do I have some kickback with this? I'm gonna start working the pink from the ColourPop palette into my eye. It's a really light pink right here. I don't know the name. I don't know if it has it on the pan. Secrets. Take it on this one. This is a Morphe G14. from this pure palette and I'm gonna go with the flow why not I'm gonna go with the Reezy that hot pink glitter shade This is the wrong brush for this, but it worked well yesterday with packing in like a glittery eyeshadow. I didn't want to do that. 
I put it too high here. I'll clean that up later with um a more neutral shade. But I just yeah. I just wanted to pack in Wild Child from the Pure Palette a little more because I feel like I've kind of blended it away. Is more this um purple glitter purple purple glitter and I'm gonna take that on this brush blue from yesterday it's the P15 wet and wild here is more noticeable like you see that transition and you don't see it as much here so I'm just gonna kind of bring it back and then now that's a little bit too harsh so I'm just gonna go in the cleaner brush And then I'm gonna clean that up, like I said, because I went up too high in my opinion. So that's what we have with that so far. I might take this purple in my lower lash. that's coming up let's see if I could get wild child a little bit oh yeah you see that comes up I'm just gonna put it like that I'm actually really feeling this palette y'all I don't know if I like that. I don't want to look. <laughs> this was a brush I used earlier with a more transition shade, the neutral shade. So I'm just kind of like, not necessarily smoking it out, but kind of blending it out. Or in, whatever. And then... I'm gonna take cupcake again. In my crease. This is a P10 for that same what I want collection, as you can tell. So I just kind of continued that same purple. to my inner corner and then take it a little bit lower I don't know let me see how I do with some clean up here and then see if I want to add or change anything so I'm going to go on with epic a pure palette and just kind of like it's a more orangey shade but it's a
I do that face every time because I honestly don't know how I feel about this. Um, so let's see. I'm going to take another. Oh, P20. And I'm going to go into Wasted. I suck at showing shades. Wasted by the in the Amnesia palette. palette. This does have a lot of kickback. And kind of do the same thing on top. Just because I didn't want it to be as orange as it came out. But that's okay. I'm going to add a little bit of Forever Lit into my inner corner. It's um, the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Glow Kit. It's just a white shade. Make it a little more um, happen. A little more like iridescent, I feel like. Cool. Alright, so I think I'm going to leave it at that for the eye look. I'm going to go with the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. I know some people don't like putting it on their eyeshadow, but like I said, Sahara Desert. So. That's what we have. Um, I have this new mascara that I tried yesterday for the first time. And I fell in love. Um, it's the Wet n Wild Mega Volume. This was $2.73 on Amazon. Amazing. size eyeshadows but I didn't use it yesterday because I did more of a bluish purple look and then I'm gonna use this lip liner from Wet n Wild Bear to Common 651B it's more of a pinky truthfully not really for this look, but I don't have my only, I don't have any other lip liner because I just ordered a bunch and all the ones I have were super old. But I just want to try. Okay, I don't like the brush. Do you see that? Don't get me wrong, this thing was like super inexpensive. I don't I forgot how much exactly. Definitely not more than five dollars, I don't think. Yeah, so I literally don't like the brush. It feels like it's gonna snap off. This is a look I came up with today. Let me know what you guys think. Um, yeah, I really hope to make more videos for you guys. I definitely want to do like a haul type of situation when I get in the rest of my packages. But as you know, 
it's a lot of stuff going on so i'm not even worried about how long it's been taking because it's been taking long but i understand and it's definitely not a priority so i could wait um yeah but let me know what you guys think like comment share and subscribe and all that stuff um yeah thanks for watching how did i forget highlight y'all thought i was done no i'm not gonna lie i was taking pictures and i was like something's missing and this was it mm, i'm losing i'm using glow getter from the cool girl palette as you can see my favorite shade um, and I'm going to mix it with 143, which is literally right next to it. Hold up my nose. My Cupid's bow. And then I'm going to put a little bit of the white. I don't know if that did anything because I can't say but now we are done all right <laughs> thanks